50 people, including two teenagers, are dead after an early morning collision in Milton, Ontario, southwest of Toronto. The cause of the crash is still under investigation. For more on this, let's go to CP24's Beatrice Baseman in Milton. Beatrice, give us the details. Two teenagers amongst the dead and just this horrific crash here early this morning. CP24 now obtaining security camera footage from a nearby homeowner. I want to warn our viewers as well. We're about to show it to you. We freeze the collision just before the moment of impact, but it shows the Honda SUV. And now we know it was a 26 year old man from Milton who was driving that Honda uh, parked at Dairy Road just at six line. We can't see the traffic light, so we don't know if it is a a red light or not, but he's parked as brake lights are on and he's struck from behind by an Infinity G35 inside that Infinity, an 18 year old man and a 16 year old girl, the man from Milton, the young woman uh, from Brampton. So just a horrific scene unfolding here overnight. It was just after 320 that first responders got the call for this horrific crash. Uh, both of the vehicles burst into flames right after the moment of impact as well. Uh, Milton firefighters came here to the scene. They extinguished the fires. Uh, they pulled all three people out of their vehicles and tragically their lives could not be saved. Uh, this afternoon, two young men, 19 and 18 year olds old, came here to the scene to try to see where it happened, get a better understanding of what happened to someone they identified to us as their friend, someone they were just with earlier yesterday evening around 9 o'clock when a car meetup was just wrapping up. Uh, here's what uh, one of this young man's friends told CP24. That's where I saw it was a good car show. We saw him we, 9 o'clock, he was like done, we all headed home. And then this morning, we were just getting tires changed on our cars, and we see this news. We're like, yeah. such a young kid just... Um, a bunch of my friends, they're, they're texting me, telling me, yo, can you check up on him? Is, is everything okay? And I was like, what, what's happening? I text him, no reply. I look in my group chats. My friends are calling me, and I found out, so... It's horrifying. It's horrible. Uh, police cleared the opened the road again around uh, 1230 this afternoon, but Halton police still remaining in the area, uh, going door to door, conducting canvases, looking for as much video surveillance and witness accounts as they possibly can to get a, a more fulsome idea of what happened in the minutes leading up to this crash. But certainly anyone that has any information, dash camera vo footage, video surveillance is asked to call Halton police. Back to you.